when recognizing what is always already present you could call it awareness you don't have to but recognize what is always already present if that has become rather natural to you and if challenges no longer pose themselves as threats but are just ease into if there's a natural ease about your everyday life and if recognizing awareness is just like that if that natural ease is there then there's at least some level of conviction you could say experiential conviction which makes you naturally at ease what you can try then in order to what you can try then in order to um, loosen the identification we have with awareness being something, some state that's located over here somewhere in order to loosen that and in order to understand experientially the unity of life this is a nice practice everything that you encounter wait just before I explain it you can also do this practice if you're not yet uh, at ease so to speak in your everyday life if recognizing awareness is still very new to you you can st still try this exercise but my bet is that it will remain mostly conceptual so you will think about it instead of relaxing and recognizing but nevertheless you can try so you just relax and everything that you encounter like this video the screen in front of you my face the fence behind me the trees behind me the dark beside me the room you're in or the open sky that you're in if you're on a cell phone the the mouse you may be holding the clothes you're wearing the thoughts that arise the emotions that arise and you just go to everything that arises to everything that's perceived or heard or sensed or smelled anything that comes to mind really you just go you all call it by the same name so whatever you prefer whether you call it God awareness unity life I think life is a nice one and then you just go this is life this is life then a struggle arises or uh, some affliction arises some doubt arises and you just go ah you don't believe in the doubt you don't enter the reality tunnel that the doubt is projecting projecting but you just allow the doubt to be and you confirm this is life this is part of life this is life this is life another emotion arises this is life so you don't stop to or rather you don't perpetuate describing everything and getting lost in all kinds of stories but you just take it as it is and you confirm it to be life you can also take the negative approach to this which is ask yourself what is not part of life so an emotion arises and you go is this not part of life is this not part of life a thought arises is this not part of life uh, a scenery beautiful scenery arises you say is this not part of life and you will find that everything without exception arises in life and therefore is life belongs to life so everything arises in life and as life or you can say awareness whatever it is but make it one name or one one essence but I suggest you try it with life but if you have something that you prefer you can do it with that word or that ID um, and what you'll find is that everything belongs to life and you just go on and you try to find something that's not life and when you realize that there's nothing that is not life and that is ev everything is the same thing basically belongs to the same essence what happens is that life becomes this seamless experience 
where even awareness isn't isolated anymore. It's just completely integrated in the experience, in whatever is perceived. There's a natural flow of everything, and there's a, um, a deepening expansion, uh, a deepening acceptance of life as it is, a deepening acceptance that everything is that life. So this is where the unity of life becomes more apparent in your direct experience. So first gain a little bit of, of familiarity and get used to this recognition of awareness to the degree where you're naturally at ease much more. And then to loosen up the identification of awareness with some kind of state, you just go and try to find something that does not belong, appear in, or is life. And you'll find that everything is life. Your depression is equally life as the body, as every other sense that you're having. Try it. It's liberating. <laughs>